Hello everyone, it's me, Andrew. In our previous video, we created an algorithm checking different parameters via conditions. You can find a link to this video in the description. In this video, let's see how to change these values using custom commands. First, let's exchange numbers with variables. In the beginning, we'll write certain numbers into variables. That is needed in case the tracker resets or depletes internal battery and turns off, since all unsaved data is stored in the RAM of the tracker and is not when power is not supplied. In order to change the values in an algorithm already loaded to the tracker, we'll add a new branch starting with an event incoming command. Let's make up the command text, for example, drive. Custom commands are recommended to be written in capital letters. In this block you create the command text and add possible arguments, which are the changeable parts of the command. For that, we choose what variables will be used to store the received arguments. We choose a variable for each argument and then finish this part, adding a finish element. Now, when we send this command to the tracker, we also write five arguments, one by one, using commas, in the same order we added them to the command block. And the algorithm will start checking the parameters using newly received limits. In order to be sure that the tracker received the command successfully, we add the send answer action block. In the text field, we make up a text and show received values. The text is written in a regular way. But in places where we want to show argument values, we add percent %d construction. Arguments in such blocks can be shown in three different formats – binary, decimal and hexadecimal. We choose decimal values, that's why we use the percent %d construction for each argument. The values will be automatically shown in these places in the same order they were added to the arguments field. And now let's check how our command works. For that we send command to the tracker using configurator tool and receive a corresponding answer. Arguments are frequently used in the commands in the tracker's firmware. For example, our familiar clear script command has one optional argument being the name of the algorithm to be deleted. In our next video, we'll add a driver identification logic using RFID or iButton readers and finish our driving style control algorithm.